the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, has arranged Bright Echefu, the CEO of Telcom Satellite Limited, TSTV, and three others on a nine-count charge of money laundering, fraud, and tax invasion. The defendants pleaded not guilty to all charges before the Abuja Division of the Federal High Court. The EFCC counsel, Tahil Silvanus, requested that Echefu and Ibu Anuga be remanded in a correctional center pending the hearing and determination of the case, citing their failure to appear for arrangement after they granted administrative bill. However, the defendant's counsel, Eyitayo Fatugu, informed the court that a bail application had been filed on their behalf in October 2023 and urged the court to admit them to bail. Justice Inyang Eko admitted Echefu and Iguanuga to bail on the terms of the administrative bail earlier granted by the EFCC with the condition that they deposit their international passport with the court registrar and do not travel outside the court jurisdiction without prior leave. The judge warned that their bail would be revoked if they fail to appear in court for their trial, which is scheduled to commence on June 15th, 16th, and on the 17th. The defendants are accused of committing money laundering offenses, including tax evasion and fraud, contrary to the Money Laundry Prohibition Act 2011 and the Advanced Fee Fraud and Other Fraud-Related Offenses Act 2006. Specifically, Echefu is alleged to have defrauded Tanimu Taminu, MD of Calcium Global and former Minister of Special Duties and Intergovernmental Affairs of 380 million, which was paid into Bridge Break Investment Limited account under false pretenses. The EFCC's action is seen as a significant step in combating financial crimes in Nigeria and the outcome of the case will be closely watched by the public and the business community. The defendant's trial is expected to be a landmark case in the fight against corruption and money laundering in Nigeria. Samuel Ohayaga, Daily News 24.